Hi, welcome to Lori's Stamping Place. Blogspot.com. I know it's been a couple months or so since I've been on and made a video. I wanted to share with you a couple of mini albums I've made for a special um, family that are expecting twins. And so, let me show you, walk you through these. So, like I said, they're twins. So these are the albums. Let me see if I can come back here a little bit. Yeah. So this is the front of the first one. And then this is the side. And let me set this down. They're, they're large ones. And then this is the back. I just love, love the paper. And it's by Stamperia. And it's the little girl collection and Shelly Geigel is the one I got the tutorial from. So that was number two, for number one. And this is the second one. And the, there are subtle differences in these. This one, the little girl's holding a brown bear. The other one, she's holding a yellow bear. And so, and there's just some like the color of the pearls and things are a little different. The little saying is a little bit different. So there's just, in the lace around it is a bit different. And then this one, again, the pearls are different. So I'm not going to keep pointing out the differences, but um, they're twins. And, and as far as I know, they're not identical twins. So let's open the, this one first. And so I stuck this little rubber band on there. I had a trying to find my the right closure I wanted to do on these. So I just did some some uh, uh, little uh, brads and made these little closures and then put the ribbon the ribbon on it. And so we'll open this up. And there's so much to these albums. I mean they're when you open this up, I mean, look at how this is. It's way over here, way over here. I don't know if I'll be able to, like, I, I'm i thinking maybe I can lay it down. And we can go through this is what I'm hoping will happen here. Um, let me see. What if I took it like this way and went down like that and showed you. So I will turn this around this way so that you have the right direction. And so this is the first page. There are, I think, 12 pages in this. So I did do the lace around the top and also around the bottom and then this one has a, a fold out and here's a little acetate place right here that you can put a photo on this uh, mat and um and then stick it back behind here there's also a little book in here so let me put this back in here and the albums are similar, like I said, but different. This has a little pull tab. Then I did this little booklet. And it goes back in here. And then we're going to open this page. And so here's a nice big place for a photo. You can put photos on there. And then here's the center. One right here. And it has a pocket, so there's a, a pocket right here. You can see these little mats. There's that little mat. I think these are such cute papers. And so these, and then on the back they can journal or put more photos or or whatever they whatever they want on there. And um, and then this was a little fold out also. Oh, it's a little fold out. I think that's such a cute, a cute little girl. 
And so then I just tuck this back in here. Let me get that in there. This is hard doing it upside down like this, but anyways. Okay, so there's that one. Then we're gonna come on over here to this page. And you can see that. So on this page here, we have a little girl that's popped up. So I popped her up on dimensionals. Here I put some little um, little bead thing, flat back bead things that look like bubbles. And then we'll put this little tab up and then this opens up. And, it, and it's a pop-up. There you can see. So you open it up and it's a little little pop out of the girl pop up with the girl on the bubble or on the bubble in the bubble bath <laughs> okay and then, then this comes back over here and we close that back up and then this one comes I see I have to stop and think of how I go how we go okay so then this one flips over here and we have this little fold out right here. I love this little pony. <clears throat> also, there's a place for a little tag behind the little pony. I'm gonna stick a tag in there. And then we have this little a place for a photo over here, place for a photo here, a little tag, some little photo mats that stick back in here, another photo mat. And they're just white on the back and another photo mat and then it flips out oh we already did it that way so that's that's that part like i said it's different looking at it at this direction and then here's another page and this page um has a little pocket and then i made a little um envelope as, like I said, this paper is just gorgeous. And then inside the envelope, I have all kinds of little goodies. Little tags they can use for putting things, writing things on. Um, these little tags. One there. One like this. I mean, this little girl is just really cute. They could even put whatever they want in here. The uh, little lock of hair or whatever. And then here's another mat. So they can use these for photo mats. They can just keep them like they are. Um, whatever they want to do with them. And then let's flip this one over. And here we have another little place that we can, you can put a photo here if you want. Um, and they, a lot of these have um, uh, Winka Stella on the on the hair on the bows on the oh yeah you, I don't know if you can see them on see it on here but there it is and then on the back I can do more journaling or photo placement whatever they want to do and then we come to this page over here and it has I put some of the <laughs> some of the uh, stuff from the baby shower in here that they had i thought i would just add that in here some of the little the things that popped out on the reveal the gender reveal not the baby shower the gender reveal and then here's a little booklet thing like this so they can put photos in there whatever they want tuck a put a photo and tuck it behind here then this opens and you have a nice big place right here for a photo and also right here for a photo and then this we're gonna open this up this is a, a twin page i mean a identical page this side and this side and so they have a place where you could put a photo back here. And then I made this little booklet 
here where they can put some photos if they want. They can journal on this side. And so it's the same over here, same exact thing with a little place for a photo and the little booklet. And then we have this big page right here. Lots of places in here for, for photos. So on this one right here, this is a, a booklet for photos and so you have let's see let's get it like this that one I think there's like one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten places for photos just in this little booklet right here and then um, Right behind it is a place. So there's a, oh, you could put like, you could use this side, that side. Like I said, you could put photos on these. So there's a couple of these mats in here. I think they're so cute. And I'll put that one and I'll put this one. And that's that page. And then it just, I didn't put any magnets in this. I just tied it with some real pretty ribbon. So um, there's that one. Then we come over here to this page. Let me get you back over here. And so here's a place for a photo right there. And then you flip this over and we have another page with um, one of these little booklet things that I did. And you can place photos on there, whatever you want. And it's tucked behind this large envelope. And there's a heart here that this also is on there. And then this, un you undo this one. And it has some of these little tags and stuff inside here. So we've got a large heart tag and this flower one and this one i just really like these and i cut around the edges of them i mean here again you can use this for putting whatever babies a little girl's first lock of hair tooth whatever actually actually um let me put this back down here actually the teeth this page here would be a good for the teeth because you have these little tiny envelopes and you you could put a baby's first lock of hair or her first tooth that she loses or whatever the little girl so here's another pocket and then here's some of these this is a double pocket so there's a pocket here with some of these little um mats in them and here's the back side of the mats. I just love this. And then here's another one over here. And then you have this pocket back here, which has this little pull, the little pull tabs to help get those ones out. And you got these little tabs on here. And it goes back, they go back behind here. And then we're gonna flip this over and we have one of these. Okay, so the what we're gonna do, let me see, I'll hold it up a little bit. What we have is with these open. So you flip this around, you flip this one around, and they're little pop-ups, and I took these from the baby the baby reveal, gender reveal also, and stuck stuck those in there. I thought that those were so cute. Put those in there and then we flip this open like this oh do we have let me get up here a, a bit so what we have here is another pocket with some larger little mats and then here again you got these little girls on this side 
I just think they're so cute. Maybe I'll put one of the little girls like this and one like this. I think they're so cute. In fact, I think I had them the other way. Uh, yeah, that's how I had them. And I'll put this one in there. And then we have another page here in the center of this little booklet. We have a pocket and then we pull out this little photo mat with the little pony. It's so cute. And then they can journal here. And we have this bit large photo mat. It's white on that side. Oh, that's cute. I like that. We'll close this one back up and we're on the back page now. Okay, so on the back page here we've got this little girl in the tub again. And we have a little pocket and I just stuck this in there they can use this put it in the album somewhere that they want put a photo on it and here we have that special day where you can journal on with it and another photo large photo mat and so that's album number one and I'll just Stick this back in here. Okay, so I'm gonna close this one back up. I just, I think it turned out so cute. I'll put it back like this. <clears throat> so that was album number one. So I'm gonna start another video because I can only do so long. And so I'm gonna, uh, uh, come back for part two. Okay. Thanks for looking and have a great day. Bye-bye.